Hey guys, I'm Rosal Vane, and welcome back to another part of Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Where we last left off was that we were basically helping out some people, uh, a lot of rebels actually so far, um, with their their fight against the uh, tyranny of some sort, I guess. Alright, but anyways, yeah, so we, we helped a bunch of rebels, one of which we had to kidnap somebody, and one of which we had to find out the traitor is a woman who used to love an, a guy that was evil. Like, one of the evil priests that we had to murder. Uh, or assassinate. Depending on who it is. Or how it is previously. Man, look at this game. This, be this game is really beautiful. Honestly, it's one of the most beautiful games out in the PC world. Uh, if it never crashes again, like, this is magnificent. Like, it would be just as mag magnificent as Final Fantasy XV would be. With, like... The scenery being so beautiful, like this, I think us Odyssey, no, not no Odyssey, Origins and Final Fantasy 15 of like 2017 for the PC, uh, <clears throat> for the PC community is like one of the best gifts out there because it has one of the beautiful like graphical like stuff to it, but the only problem was just like technical stuff that I encountered. Well, it's for me, like only me encountering them. Some people might not encounter them either. Uh, and some people might have a better. No one is safe. It is this cursed temple. I told you, it is a blasphemy. The gods are angry. Uh, okay, I guess. Let me go grab these chests. I actually see the the chest down here. My assumption is that that staircase leads down to that chest. I think. Okay, well, those guys who died, I killed. I killed them. I killed them in the last episode. They haven't refreshed yet. <laughs> they haven't been removed yet. Do I just climb from here? I guess. Oh yeah, I do. Okay. Drop. Ah, I see. Okay. Okay, it makes sense. Hey. I think I got him in the head. <clears throat> Oh, there we go. Oh, <laughs> he's dead. Uh. Oh, that was a miss. Oh, got him. And he's dead. Nighty night. All right, cool. Pick those up. Yeah, this is a random. This is a re really random, like underground stash. Really, it's so random. I don't know. Because they got nothing. Right, let's drop down and smash through this door, I guess. There we go. What do we have? Shield. I can sell. A saber sword, whatever it is. That I can sell as well. Hey, I leveled up. Yeah, 29. Hell yeah. Alright, damage and health is increased. Oh, there's stuff here. I was like, is there nothing else here? No way. <laughs> but there is stuff there. Alright, cool. Get out of here. Alright, so that's that, I guess. That was really random, but I'll take it. Um, alright, let's go back to the murder. I actually held off on that because I was like, I saw like a bunch of treasures in the way of my sight. Oh, there's the papyrus. Let's also pick up the papyrus. I know I'm just like collecting things out of nowhere. I should be doing main or side quests and main quests, but I end up getting distracted by them a lot, often. Um, and that's usually the way to go. Alright, here we are. Here's the entrance. It's up there. Gotta climb on these bodies of a person. Alright, there we go. In here. Yeah, grab this papyrus. There we go. Leaning tower, okay. Another 300 XP. Actually, 
Do I have enough for something I really want to upgrade to? Like for the abilities, I wonder. Uh, yeah, we have a lot of papyrus in a weird way. But we just never hunt down any of like the secret stuff because we don't have- I don't even have the time to even look for them. Alright, so let's let's see, what do we have? So we got these two here, they're golden circles, or there's circles around them, uh, that glowed up. What is this? Ooh! Ooh! That's a good one. What is this one? Enhanced light bow? Nah, I don't use light bow as much. Enhanced warrior bow? Eh, maybe. Berserk. Backstores have rarer gears. Rarer quality gears in shops. I actually wanted this for a while, but I just never upgraded it because I forgot all about it. Uh, but this is gears. It's not items. So I don't think it matters to me a little bit. Uh, so I'm, I'm going to do this. I'm going to go enhancement bows because I think that that's one of those things I've never gotten to. It pierces through shields. Ooh. That's very cool. I actually want that too. What is this? Elite Ranger. Alright, that's slow down in the air thing. Yeah, because I heard that this game... Or not, not this game. Maybe Odyssey was. But like... Paya, why are you... His skin looks grayish for some reason in there. Yeah, in the light it looks kind of normal. I just realized that. I never knew. Yeah, without light he has like some shiny gray skin that's that's interesting i never thought of it or i never saw of that ow it's fine i didn't i'm not in a fight anyway so it doesn't matter all right here we go all right let's go look into this murder back. Back. Keep back. This doesn't concern it. shut up are you the philakitai yes Try not to trample the scene. My job is hard enough as it is. Oh, my apologies. As a protector, I am attracted to such scenes. A fellow protector? Ah, yes, I see your badge. You are a Magi from the old kingdom. Wow. Forgive me. This gruesome business has us all on edge. Huh? This is the latest in a series of chilling ritual murders by uh, wadget cultists. To be honest, I'm a little out of my depth. Yeah. I may be of some use to you. I am not unfamiliar with murder scenes. True. I mean, we've... Perhaps you could help investigate. The cultists usually leave a message. I haven't figured it out yet. We could check the temple. Okay. You said there have been other murders. The cultists are murdering temple acolytes, public figures in Karanis. No one knows why. Anyone could be their next target. The Greeks are terrified. They're saying locals are involved and are calling for blood. <gasps> All right. Uh, okay. I, I was like, what am I looking for again? The timing is inconvenient. Years of work building over the poorly constructed Egyptian temple. Endless delays and problems. Now this. There is a lot of pressure to solve this. But please, take your time. Enjoy the temple. Why would you enjoy the temple when everyone's dead or some people are dying? There's a lot of blood. Someone was bound and tortured here in front of this statue. And by the signs, they were cut up badly then dragged outside. Ah. It must have been the poor acolyte. There was no one else here. Why did they do this? I don't know why the camera was facing in a weird way. Could have been facing towards like the ground where the, the crime scene is at. A Greek god where an Egyptian god once stood. This would make some in Egypt very angry. Someone has smeared the god with green paint. Ah. The head has also been covered. Wait. Something else is up there. Wait. Oh, it is covered. Okay. Uh. How do I do this? Uh, over here. There we go. 
Interact. Set up his face is hidden and defaced with more green paint. The green mask of Wajet has been placed here. Ah. Wajet is goddess protector of Upper and Lower Egypt. Someone is making a clear statement. But how did they get up here carrying all of this? Okay, so that makes sense a little bit. Amun. This is written in blood. It is still wet. Filthy Greek. Also, pause and read to any like documents. I forgot to mention that now because I, I guess throughout the whole series I've mentioned it many times, so I forget sometimes. The murderers are going to kill the high priest next. Ooh. We have to find him. Okay. If Lakita, I should know where he is. All right, let's go. Ugh. Again. Okay. Where's this guy? Gotta talk to this guy. Tell me where the hell your freaking high priest is at. Felakitai, I found the cultist message. They're going to kill your high priest next. The high priest? By Serapis, no. Karani's spirit will die if he does. We need to find him. Where is he? Think, Felakitai. His villa is nearby. I know of a spot overlooking it from a safe distance. This way. Lead the way, quickly. The whole area from the temple wall. Your temple is the reason for this trouble. It is a bitterness for the locals. <laughs> That's absurd. It has increased industry and trade. Everyone has benefited. Your dead acolyte and high priest may not agree. Gods, the trouble I'll get if the high priest lies dead. We must hurry. I mean, I like how the map shows it to me rather than me following the guy, but that makes sense a lot because it wastes my time if I'm trying to... If I'm trying to protect the guy, I guess. Hello. Goodbye. There's one guy down. There's gonna be two more dead bodies soon. Oh! Oh, oh. Ah. I will beat him. Look at your Greek master. Oh. In my way. Oh, jeez. Said you back to Ptolemy in pieces. What a clean shot. Oh, not again. What, what, what? What are you guys doing? Screw you. Oh, ho, ho. Dead he is. <clears throat> Alright, cool. Alrighty. They were going to sacrifice me. To what? You are safe now. It is fortunate you are not at the temple. Yep. You would already be dead. Serapis, <coughs> you would have butchered me. These Egyptians are prayerless demons and not men. It was an Egyptian who saved you, priest. Remember that when you pray and give thanks. We Medjai protect all, regardless of their class. And even the race, I would say. I came as soon as the fighting began. I see I am too late. Thank you for your help, Medjai. It certainly made my work here easier. Yep. You have interesting timing. What do you know of these bandits? Egyptians unhappy with the Greeks here. Who knows what holes they crawl from. Seeing a Greek god in place of their own incensed them, no doubt. Probably. Understandably. You've not seen the last of such trouble, I think. The Ptolemies tend to divide us at times. Mm. Sadly, I agree. Greece has brought Egypt much wealth, yet some resist all progress. This depends on your idea of progress. Progress for Egypt or for Greece. Farewell, Felakitai. Next time you protect, remember my code. I'm very curious about how this would tie into Odyssey still. Because I know Odyssey is a different type of... Uh... I know Odyssey is a different type of game with everything and all that, but... Oh gosh, there's another side quest. Or another, yeah, another side quest here. Oh, they have a track, a track marker for walking now. That's interesting. I saw you with the Felakitai of Karanis. Are you a protector? Yes. I am. Is there something wrong? Yeah, is there something wrong? Please, we need your help. Yesterday, my husband witnessed oh. something frightening. Soldiers dragged a poor man beneath the temple. Then he heard screams. 
We're already hungry because there's no grain. Oh. Now I'm terrified the soldiers will take my husband. We don't know who we can trust. Not even the Philakitai. Oh my. Let me talk to your husband. Where can I find him? He's a stone mason working near the temple. Please be careful. The soldiers mustn't see you talk to him. Why wouldn't you want the soldiers to see me talk to the guy? Like, that's the point of me being there, you know? I gotta be there to talk to them. Talk to your husband. Anyways, let's, let's get in there anyways. Yeah, it's just random as hell to like... I, I didn't know that there, there was actually Greece. I didn't know that there was Greece, uh, Greek related like nations that actually resided in Egypt. I just didn't know that. There were like Greek people residing in, uh, like Greek re residing in the nation and also like putting on their own like religious figures here. It's really interesting, nonetheless. Stone Mason, your wife has been to see me. How did you get up here? <laughs> By a moon, that woman interferes. I told her. What can we do? Just act normal. Yeah, that's it. Stay normal. <laughs> Calm yourself. She said you saw soldiers take someone below the temple. Yes. No! Yes. <laughs> okay, it's true. It wasn't the first time. But yesterday was different. There were screams that would wake the gods themselves. So many screams. Now please... Just leave me alone before someone sees you. Just act normal. <laughs> this guy. He can't act normal, really. Alrighty, cool. So that's that. So we had to go beneath the temple ruins. I feel like I've been there and I killed a bunch of guys down there to collect their secret stash. But that's just probably me. This looks like the place the stonemason told me about. Oh, wait, this is, yeah, this is the place I freaking killed all those guys already. By a moon? What has been done here? Your payment is the usual place beneath the bathing... Bathing Sopic, I think it said. No disappoint- Oh, the crocodile! This is related to Someone the crocodile. Someone called the butcher is strong-arming farmers. I need to find him. I should follow this trail of loot. A bathing Sobek. Bathing? Must be in water. A sobek in water. Hmm. Alrighty. Well, I already took out the loot anyways. I kind of eliminated all the threats way earlier. See, this is what I mean. Like, something random like that. <clears throat> something random like this is, like, funny. Because I'm like, I already took out these guys. Because I was into the loot already. But yet, like... I come back and I'm just like, I'm doing this for another purpose rather than just taking the loot. It's like funny. Like if I didn't, if I didn't care for the loot, I would have been like, you know, I would have had to fight them anyways, but then again, still. Uh, down again. Drop, 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 drop down. Alright, cool. Gotta drop down some more again. Alright, cool. I don't really need, ha like, leathers. I don't need their leather. I just need the, uh, crocodile skin. Or the tiger skins. Which, I don't know if we're- if we can even fight tigers in this game. Which we shouldn't be, because they're extinct and endangered now, but... In-game-wise, it makes sense, because that's what it is. I mean, it's funny because this is the only game, or this is one of the many games, but the only game that I know of that by all means utilizes animal skin and killing animals as a way to upgrade yourself. There's a Sobek ruin not far from here. The butcher's loot could be nearby. Alright. Well, at least it's probably bringing me out of the town so that I don't come back to the town and again. Hopefully it doesn't make me come back to the town. Wait, what? There we go. I don't know what the hell is over there, but there's like a lot Those of like. Guards. This must be the place. There's a lot of crocodile the fighting there. So big, should be close. Oh, my bad. Oh. Oh. 
Oh, there goes that guy. I didn't mean to freaking switch out to the, my other weapon anyways. I don't know why they... I keep freaking doing that by accident. Oh, wait, what? There's a bunch of flamingos dead. <laughs> a bunch of dead flamingos here. Alright, here we go. Sunken Temple of... Numa... Numa... Numa Paris? Too late. There we go. I helped the guy too. Like, I killed the uh, alligators up, up here. I killed these guys, and yet you guys are doing stuff to me. Ah, it's son of a gun. Okay, fine, whatever. There we go. There we go. There we go. Get all my stuff back. Lake. That must be the baby sorbet from the butcher's letter. Ah, there it is. There's some other treasures too, which is interesting. Alright, here we go. Grab that. Get her hurry up and grab this thing quickly. There is an engraving on the chest depicting Soknopayu. That is a village west of here. The coins are in bags normally used to store grain. Did this come from a storehouse? Alright, we found some clues. Woo! That was a really that was a really fruitful task. Very, very, very fruitful. Alright, let's get to the warehouse as fast as we can here. Yeah, it's taking us everywhere, which is funnier. Why is the horse in a weird color? This horse has like a weird ass color. It's like green, green, like mossy coloring. All right. Somebody better put it out. Get it. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Man, I wish I could double assassinate, but I can't. Actually, I don't even know how much people are in here. Is this just... Are these just the three last people, I guess? My assumption is that there's only three people left. Yeah, there's only three people left, I think. That's my assumption. Alright, I'm gonna switch back over to the... the the uh, poisonous one. Uh, he's dead, anyways. I have the bastard. There we go. He's dead. Yeah, I really need to upgrade the other sword. I think. Ow. Where? What? What? Where is he going? Where is he? There we go. There we go. Perfect. Alright. Let me see, actually. Did I really upgrade? Okay, so I did upgrade it, but it's not strong enough for some reason. Yeah, this one has critical hit damage. This has critical hit rate. And health... Oh, so it has lifesteal, basically. I have a bit of lifesteal. Yeah, I prefer this one still, because it has more strength than hitting. And the bleeding on hit is very useful, still. I don't know. Other than that, I mean, there's nothing much to it beyond that. Alright, is there materials that I still haven't gotten yet? Yeah, I still need a lot more bronze. In a funny way, I just need more bronze. I need some wood, some tiger skins for the other three things. 
It's so it's, it's kind of ridiculous, but I guess that's how it is. Because the more higher up you get, the more rare the items are. All right, let's get to this point, I guess. Uh, did I miss out on? Okay, I didn't miss out on anything yet. Okay, cool. I thought I missed out on like the viewpoint on uh, along the way, but it seems like it's leading me to the right places. I think so far. Actually, let me see if there's any more on the other. Okay, there's nothing more. Okay, there's no more like quest stuff, like side quests over there. So I'm good. If they if they generate more, I'm just gonna probably have to f figure that out later, I guess. Um, but at the moment, I really don't think I can spend more time in the same spot if there's not much there. And here I am, at last, in the Fayum. Oh, this is the city that's being. I will root out the agents of the crocodile. Well, I mean, I'm doing another thing. I'm doing a completely different thing, but I didn't know that this is the area I need to be in for that one place. All right, let me go grab this viewpoint first before we continue into the fight. Vault of Splendors. I just want to get the viewpoint, damn it. Eh. That's not where I want to go. Oh, there we go. Up, 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 up. Up, this way, up, up, up. There we go. Cool. Over this naked butt. <laughs> oh my god, that's so funny. It's like a freaking butt. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna get this hopefully as a viewpoint checkup. Go. Fast travel unlocked, world map updated, and Sydney's perception is good. Is there a uh, haystack or something? That doesn't look like a haystack, so I'm scared. Yeah, there's no haystack down there. It looks like I had to climb down myself. Oh no, there's a haystack. I like how there's actual signs telling you where you where you can jump off of, and they use birds as a way for that. Everyone, be, 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 be careful! What? C curse of Wadget! <laughs> I like how he's just like stuttering a lot. <laughs> Watch out for the. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm making fun of the guy. I shouldn't be making fun of people. Of guards for a simple storehouse. Oh, hi, bud. Oh, he's dead. Oh! Ow! I wasn't even prepared, either. Ow. Everybody who comes in who are, like, new fighters are, like... They have, like, the one hit first, and then I fight them dead. Well, I already got past them. What are these goons hiding? Nobody says, wait and waits for them, you know? Like, I don't- I don't- Here they took his arm at the butcher's order. I guess we are common thugs now, not soldiers. Shh, keep your voice down. Kamoto, this is not what I joined the army for. Me it is what puts grain on your table. You are here now. When the butcher says jump, we jump. Me that is how it is. Shut up before someone hears us. I'm already hearing you. This is where they are hiding all the grain. Taken straight from the tables of Fayum families. Damn this greedy naked yadet. I should look around. Oh wait, what? Oh, oh, uh. Ah. Ah. Hi, bud. And dead. I'm sorry, bud. I had to kill you. Even though you have to feed your family and you didn't sign up for the army for this. Like, I, I, I like how people say that they signed up for the wrong things, but they still had to manage their job of protecting whatever it is. Pause and read, of course, but it looks like they made a mistake. Ah, it looks like this is it. 
The butcher is in the villa nearby. All right, this well... This time, this butcher and I had a talk. Well, apparently I didn't realize I would find the thing immediately. Thought there was more investigation to do, but it wasn't. <laughs> I wonder where this leads me to. Imagine it's like, wherever I go, I just immediately find the, the, the actual true path of going to the thing I need to go to. That's, it would be always funny. Like, I, I found like... It's, this is the second time in a row where I'm just like, a I picked up... Villa. Built on the backs of Fayum's farmers, no doubt. Hey, wait. Hey. Oh. Die. Die. Well, this guy doesn't have, like, much on a shield, I think. There we go. Alright, let me pick up this. There we go. I was like, why the hell is it picking up the wrong thing? I'm wanting the loot. Oh, there's two loots in one. Okay. That's funny. Alright, let's see what's up here. Alright, those those guards. That's not a guard. What is this? Okay, well, I don't know. It looks like there's a sandstorm coming in, too. I don't know. Ah, here's the Vlaka who's been messing with my business. What? I just barely got into your business. We were just discussing you. You've been stealing grain from Fayum, starving people for profit. You're not from Fayum, are you? Nope. Your speech reeks of the countryside. That Screw grain you. belongs on Egyptian tables. You naive backwater Malakia. I take orders from above. If not me, someone else will do this. This is business. People pay what they owe, or I take it. It's not personal. I give you a choice now. Leave me alone and live, or die here. I don't I think I'll the take- the way that you do. Then they murdered my son. Everything is personal. You filthy Nekatiadet! I don't know what that word means, but... They think they can kill me, but... Here. Oh, God, take care of this. You're dead. You are dead. Well, they can't protect him, so why are they still fighting? Why are you still fighting me when you're dead already? No. There we go. I'm gonna switch over to the other sword for now. Confirm kill. May the hidden one greet you. The Lord of the Duat awaits. All right. Wow, that's a lot of EXP. That's a whole lot. Man, that gave me like halfway through my freaking thing already. Damn, that's fast. I don't know, it's like so fast already. Like so far this game is going faster as as long as I'm still doing side quests, uh, I'm leveling up faster than I should be. Grab the loot here. There's a blue thing over there, it looks like. Uh, let's see if we can grab whatever this blue thing is. Yeah, let's see if we can grab this. I don't think we can. I have to go from like the other side, I think. Alright, let me go and grab this and I should end the episode here. But thank you guys for watching. Leave a like, comment, subscribe if you guys haven't. Hope you guys in the next part and nobody minds. And hope you guys have a great, amazing. Pause and read it, but it looks like the physician is out because of how much people want it help, it looks like. Ah, there we are. Grab those things. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Leave a like, comment, subscribe if you guys haven't. Hope you guys in the next part of Nobody Minds. And hope you guys have a great, amazing day, week, and night, or whenever watching this. Uh, in the next episode, I would like to deal with... Uh... Yeah, in the next episode, I want to deal with these side quests, though. There's the Curse of the Wage... Wajet... Wajet? I don't know how to pronounce it. And the Rebel Strike, which we're coming up here with those two soon. Um, We're to level 29, and we're already, like, halfway... We're beyond the halfway point of leveling up, so it's really interesting how things are like quickening up with the experience points being racked up, which is cool. But also at the same time, it's very scary because I'm like, I have to fight stronger things eventually, or I have to handle stronger missions eventually, um, which is kind of crazy. Uh, so need to do some of these things eventually. Um, 
I really wish I could find some of these things. I actually should take some time to find out how to get through most of the Taste of First Thing and the old library because those are the ones who I can't find very well. Ambush at Sea was held back because I couldn't do it yet, I think. So I can probably go back and do this one in general. Uh, is there a... Oh, there is a merchant right here. Or a blacksmith. Now let's go to the blacksmith too. Uh, but yeah, in the next episode, we will go and go off into the side quests and deal with those. Uh, so far, it's been, we're, we're doing things smoothly. Everything is moving smoothly. Uh, yeah, there's the side quest guy again. Um, everything's going smoothly. We're getting through as much as we can quickly. Uh, not as quickly as I think I would be, but I think it's quick enough that I'm not being held back from things. So let's sell some stuff. Uh, yes. I don't know what I'm selling here. Like, I don't know what thing to sell, really. I know I'm selling those, because I don't use those. My problem is I don't know what weapon is what. Okay, I can sell these shields. This is definitely for sure. Because they're giving me the ra the same old shields for like the long t longest time. Um. Definitely gone. All right. Definitely gone. I'm guessing I'm equipped with this one. Yeah, that's equipped. I'll sell this one for now. I'll take. I think I have like Hunter's Bow already, but I don't know which. I'll sell this one for now. All right. I'll sell this because I got the Golden Spear. Uh, I already got two of them, so I don't need another one. Let me see my weapons because I don't know what to sell actually. I, I really just went with whatever I felt. Alright, so I don't really need that. I don't need another Warrior's Bow because I have another one now. Because I got this one unlocked. Predator Bow, I just need to keep one of them, it seems like, so. Uh, yeah, I just need to keep one of them. Um, let me go and sell. The uh, this thing. How I waste some more. I'll take it. And the warrior spell, same. What was the other thing? I'm trying to memorize like what I what I have to sell. I'm sorry here. Like I'm trying to finish this episode, but I'm like, <laughs> I'm trying to get all the stuff sold so I don't get it into the point where I don't remember. So I'm gonna try to equip this guy instead of this guy. But critical. Oh, it's because of the critical hit that I like it. Okay, I'm gonna sell Hades anyways, but I'm gonna try to. Come to trade, then. I like the critical hit because the critical hit is really useful. Um, so I'm gonna sell the Hades anyways. All right. Um, I didn't check my gears for this one, so I want to keep Golden Wolf because that's gold. Uh, Hack and Slash is the only one I have. I can sell the Blunt. I can sell the Heavy Blade. I can actually sell my Golden Spear, but I like the critical hit and rate, which is really good. So. Um, it's way better than the the given item that was from the Ubisoft store. So let me sell this guy. Sell okay. this guy as well. Keeping the top two and that. And we should be good. Alright, let's buy uh, materials here. Lots of bronze. Give me all your bronze. Agreed. And give me all your wood too. A fair price, no? No, not really. And let's upgrade one thing. Let's see, we're level 29, so this is not necessary. Uh, the Fang is at 27, but it's not going to be up by a lot if I powered it up. The Spear is great, but I'm not sure yet. How's the bow looking, actually? Predator Bow, which should be upgraded soon. This is behind a little bit, the Crescent Moon. On fire. The shield is already at the level I need it to be, so maybe I'm gonna upgrade the the lowest level one, which is the Predator Bow. Or the Meat Bow, I mean. Yeah, the Predator Bow. Whatever. Perfect. That goes up. Uh, and I'm gonna power up the Crescent Moon, I think. Or maybe not. I don't know. Or maybe the Fang, I guess? Because I do respect the Fang a lot. I'm gonna do this one anyways. Screw it. It's not really well worth it, but it's it's better than not. 
Alright, we're good. Uh, I do need to save my money for other materials that I want to build later on, so... Yeah. Um... What? Wait, what? Why is there a range thing? What? Why is the range 1? What? <laughs> I'm confused. Why is it still telling me 1? Okay, I don't know what happened there. I really don't know what happened. Okay, I don't know what that was. It, it, the, like, the 1 showed up out of nowhere. Alright, so we need... Two more coppers for quivers upgrade. But I want to get the stabilizers so that it can increase my range damage. Or maybe the hidden blade, I don't know. Whichever. But I want my range damage to go up because right now that's the weakest out of everything so far. Yeah, it's only two so far. Yeah, I really wish to increase some of these things, but I really need to keep buying consistently on these things in order to actually be better at them. But other than that, thank you guys for watching. Um, I'm pretty much am done for today. Uh, I, I extended myself by accident because I wanted to just fix some of the stuff like that. Oh, there's the club unit thing. Yeah, so they're now called the club units. That's the thing I talked about in the last episode where uh, you play points are gone. Now it's going to be called club units now. Uh, because Ubisoft wanted to ditch the name because it sounded terrible maybe. And they wanted to make it much more... They want to make the units much more important than just to buy like reward stuff i guess it was i don't know uh but we'll see what happens because i do have some points and i accumulated a lot of them because of how much games i've played from ubisoft and whatever it is but other than that that's it for me in this part and in the next episode again we'll do the side quest and hopefully things will go well and smooth again so Roz. Uh -huh.